Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with the second half of that select basketball case that we opened up. 1819 Panini Select Basketball. Six box random team break number 10. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it. There are the combo teams right there. Heat, Wizards, Pelicans, and Raptors. Let's randomize each list. One and a two, three times. One, two, and three. After three times, we've got Jeremy 33 on the pole and Michael Grego in the 28th spot. And then three times for the teams. One, two, and three. After three times, the Warriors down to the Clippers. All right, so here we go. Jeremy, Warriors, I think again, right? Mark with the Knicks, the Grizz, and the Hawks. Chris with the Suns. Mark with the Heat and Wizards. Uh, Mark Glassman, Boombox with the Kings. Stephen K, you got the T-Wolves. Jesse with the Sixers. Quack with the Bucks. Mark with the Bulls. Mark Matheson with the Thunder. Chris with the Hornets. David with the Cavs. It's Big Boys 007's birthday today, folks. Cavs. Matt Stone, Rockets, Jeremy 33, Celtics, Chris Layton, you got the Mavs, Lakers, Pistons, Mavs again. Mark with the Magic, Christopher Bay with the Pelicans, Raptors combo, Jeremy 33 with the Nuggets, Dennis with the Nets, Chris Parent with the Jazz, Mark Matson with the Trailblazers, Matt Stone with the Pacers, Boombox with the Spurs, last but not least, Michael with the Clip Show. Let's sort this by team name. And any trades? And remember, I marked all of these. Uh, marked all of these number ten for break ten. I think we have another case of this in the store. We might post another half case break at some point. We'll run that back. We got the Magic up for trade. Golden State up for trade as well. All right, now RTR, Real Time Ref, was saying that Russell Westbrook is three rebounds away from a 20-20-20, and apparently he got it. Wow. Yep, same case, Jesse. Remember, we marked those number 10, so you know that it's from the same case. Clippers are up for trade. Oh, that's right. Done did it is Michael Gregg. i got to remember that. Magic for Golden State, maybe. Golden State for Sixers. Jesse? T-Wolves are up for trade. Pistons for Clippers, maybe. Jesse passes on the Warriors. It's a lot of trade chatter, folks. If you're watching the replay of this, you can obviously fast forward through this part. Unless you want to watch this part. It's really not that exciting. All right. Trade window going once. Trade window going twice. Nuggets for Clippers, maybe. Otherwise, trade window is closed. Nuggets for Clippers. Pistons for Clippers, yes. Unless you want Nuggets for, for, for Clippers, Michael. And Chris, are you still good with Pistons Clippers? Want to get some confirmations here. Nuggets for Magic, maybe, Jeremy? Mark's asking. All right, so Nuggets for Magic so gets a no thanks. 
What do we think about Pistons Clippers, Chris Layton? We want to go with that? Want to confirm that? Okay, so no for Nuggets Clippers, Jeremy. And uh, Michael definitely wants to let that Pistons Clippers trade stand if Chris Layton says yes. He says yes. Okay. So Detroit for LAC confirmed. All right. So Chris is out of the Pistons spot. Michael is out of the Clippers spot. Michael is now in the Pistons spot. Put a T next to there, not a Y, a T next to there for trade. Chris with the clip show right there. So T next to there, just so we know, you know, if you're keeping score at home, you can see who draws first blood in the trade. It's always an interesting storyline in every break. All right, let's print and let's rip. Good luck, everybody. And there you go. There it is, right there. So now Chris Layton has both of the Los Angeles teams. And there's everyone else. Exactly, Jeremy. So he took the Pistons over the Nuggets. So we'll see how that how that plays out. All right. Good luck, everyone. Tony. Are we running behind tonight? No. I'm exa running exactly on time. We're doing select right now and then triple threads after this. We are on time. And nothing else is filled up after that, everybody. So head over to jazbeescasebreaks.com and see what's going on there. There's some breaks that are pretty close to filling up on the website. Check it out. We break until 11 o'clock Pacific tonight, folks. So, got plenty of time to fill a break, do the break, watch a little baseball. I got Dodgers, Giants at Dodgers right now. Go Dodgers. Talk sports, listen to some music, kick back and relax on a Tuesday, folks. Oh, yard! Oh, no, he just missed it. Bellinger just missed it. Warning track power. All right, now first half of the case had a lot of vet autographs or retired legends autographs. So our guess, was, our, th our thinking was that this side should have some more rookie autographs. So let's see if that's the case. Good luck, everybody. And lead off with DeAndre Jordan. There's Dario Saric for the T-Wolves to 175. Are those numbered? No, these ones aren't numbered, but they will ship. And our first hit is going to be, wow, Luka Doncic autograph. We had a one-of-one one die cut in the first half of the case. And now a Luka Doncic autograph in the second half of the case. And guess what? Chris Layton got randomized the Mavs in break nine and got the one-of-one. One. Got randomized the Mavs again here in break 10. And now the Luka Doncic auto. 71 out of 199. Of course, we're just six off the jersey number as usual. We never hit those jersey numbers here, Chris. Woo! That is nice. <laughs> Folks, we may pull big hits. We never hit jersey numbers, by the way. Just keep that in mind. If that's what you're interested in collecting, we can't help you. <laughs> nice Luka Doncic. Chris Layton can't believe it. Wow, he says. Congrats, man. Go buy a lottery ticket. There's Michael Bridges, jersey, for the Suns. That goes to Chris Layton as well. Right after the 
Uh, we don't hit jersey numbers, Jeremy. Thirty-three. We like once in a while. But it's, it's not very common at all. It's as rare as a Luka Doncic one of one. Nerlens Noel to one forty-nine. It's not really our thing, though. There's exceptions to the rule sometimes. <laughs> There's Lamarcus Aldridge, but generally we don't. Those will uh, sleeve and top, or we, they're already sleeved, but we'll top load those before they go out. Taj Gibson, throwback memorabilia. That'll be for OKC. That goes to Mark Matheson. I don't know. We never seem to hit jersey numbers when we need to. Like Luka Doncic. How come it couldn't be 77? Of? Just not our, th not our thing. There's Russell Westbrook at a 75. 20, 20, and 20 for him tonight. Did I? Oh, all right. I pulled a 2 out of 10 Matt Ryan jersey. There you go. I feel like we're always just a, just a few off. That's what it seems like anyway. All right, that was box one. Box two. Well, Russell Westbrook. Oh, he was all right. He was playing the Lakers tonight. Lakers were pretty much fielding their G League squad out there. Um, Russell Westbrook went for 20 points, got 20 rebounds and 21 assists to beat the beat my Lakers 119 to 103. The leading scorer for the Lakers, Contavious Caldwell Pope, 23 points, five rebounds, four assists. Any other games tonight? No, oh, no other no other finals tonight. The Hawks Spurs game is almost done. Three minutes and 37 seconds left in the game. Spurs with a four-point lead, 108-104 in San Antonio. And uh, in the second quarter, 10 minutes left in the second quarter, Rockets are up on the King, 35-25. Jeremy says, if I want to waste my time, I would put together a montage of Jaspi jer jersey number hits. Well, that's misleading. We have hit those. No, not common. What you'd have to do, Jeremy, is you'd have to look at all of the hits that we've pulled, take the percentage of hits that are actually jersey numbers, get that percentage, and then cross-reference it with two or three other breakers to see how often they hit jersey numbers, probably more often, and then we'll have that percentage. It's true. All right, there's Evan Fournier, Orlando Magic to 299. Kevin Huter to 149. And we've got Wendell Carter Jr. autograph, Mr. Wendell. 182 out of 199 for the Bulls. Boombox with doubles. There you go, Mark. We got die cut Steven Adams. We got Steven Adams for the Thunder, 246 out of 249. X-Factor, Alan Crabb. Sounds like a jersey number is coming tonight, Jeremy 33. Probably not. Doesn't happen very often. If we do get a jersey number, it'll be for someone, like, just random. Maurice Harkless, 
Gold autograph. It's not one we really need the jersey number to ha happen. Never happens. One out of ten. Maurice Harkless, just three off the jersey number. Aaron Holiday, die cut. Ryan says, I don't think anyone knows that song. What song? Oh, Mr. Wendell by Arrested Development? Of course people do. Don't they? Next box. Um, yes, yeah, sorry, did I not say it? Yes, you do. Mark M has the uh, has the trailblazer, so he gets that Maurice Harkless. Next box. No, oh, sorry, I should have said it. I forgot to say. You have the Hawks. You have the Grizzlies, Mark M. Heat Wizards, Knicks, Thunder, Magic, and Trailblazers. Next one. We got we got throwback memorabilia. DeAndre Jordan. That goes to Chris Layton, who got the Clippers in a trade. So he draws first blood in the trade. So let's see if it can be evened out for the Pistons for Michael Grego. 99 out of 99. Ben Simmons. And behind Michael Bridges is Kevin Durant again. Oh, just a relic. We had his autograph in the first half. Jeremy, 33 with the Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Game war material on that, Jeremy. Nice. Not numbered. No jersey number. There's Hassan Whiteside, 133 out of 299. Robert Williams III, 61 out of 99. What is, what is that right there? Jersey and autograph. It looks like... It looks like something in the manufacturing. It's like a cut or a dent or something like that. Like a knife went through it or something like that. If you talk to Panini, who has a Celtics? Jeremy. Generally, they can dig up a replacement for you or something like that if you want to go through the trouble. 61 out of 99 on that one. No jersey number. Paul George, 78 out of 99 on that die cut, OKC, Mark with that one, Mark Matheson. And look at this, Luka Doncic, Copper. 10 out of 60. 
Man, that is also probably worth a lot too, as far as he's out of 60s go. It's another one for Chris Layton. It's courtside level as well. What a break for the Dallas Mavericks. There's Dennis Schroeder at a 199. I know, a crazy Luca case. All right. Next box, we're halfway through this half case break. Uh, no, this is not a first off the line, Jesse. The boxes generally say there's either a sticker there or it'll be printed on the box. So it'll say it's first off the line. I don't know if they, did they do a, I'm sure they did do a first off the line off the select, but. No, and we would also mention in the item description as well, or the title, just so people can differentiate. All right, next box. Good luck. Great case so far. Let's keep going. Let's finish strong. There's Enos Cantor, Relic. That is for the Jazz, Chris Parent on the board. LeBron James shut down for the rest of the year. And there's Rajon Rondo, 4 out of 10. I think he's still playing. Throwback memorabilia, throwing it back to the Celtics. Jeremy, 33. Nice. Four out of ten. Just five off the jersey number. DeAndre Jordan, White Prism, to 149. Derek Favors, 10 out of 25. And Big Shot Rob, Robert Ori, in-flight signatures. And that is for the Rockets. Rockets edition going to Matt Stone. There you go, Matt. Forty-one out of one ninety-nine on that one. Nice. It's been a very strong case. There's Trey Young. 138 out of 199, Ice Tray. They're playing the Spurs right now. Spurs are still leading 117 to 111 with just less than 30 seconds left. If Luka Doncic didn't exist, I feel like Trey Young would be would be a great candidate for Rookie of the Year, right? There's Anthony Simons to 249 for Mark M. And two boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Two boxes to go. Good luck.
I think you're right, Jeremy. Jeremy's like, this has probably been the best Jaspi select case that you've seen. I think so, too. I mean, they've all been pretty solid, but... Yeah, I, th I think this one definitely is pretty good. It is Rex. Rex is like, hey, no one wants that flawless collegiate football? It is a great deal. I think we're going to do this. Triple threads right after that. Nothing else is sold out after that, so... I'm sure that Inception will go tonight, and Supreme Hardcourt will go tonight. And maybe towards the end of the night, you know, we'll be like, hey, maybe we should work on that flawless collegiate football. Mahomes edition. It's 2017, so it's Patrick Mahomes edition. Nice little blast from the past. All right. There's Markeith Morris, select swatches for the Wizards. That goes to the Heat Wizards combo for Mark. Nice base hit, Kike Hernandez. There's Kevin Knox, Knox in the box. For you daily fantasy players, Kike Hernandez always hits Madison Bumgarner really well. Joe Babcock, what's going on? Bob Wessel's asking, hey, is anyone excited for honors football? Not sure how I feel about it yet. Well, when they previously did honors football, we sold a lot. I, I think it looks awesome. So if it's anything like the last edition, then I think we're in for a good ride. Fair? No. Anthony Davis-Lime going to Pelicans-Raptors combo. Chris Bay. There's Blake Griffin, 27 out of 4, 249. No, he's 23, right? Different number. Um, that's Pistons Blake Griffin. That goes to Michael. And we've got Elliot Kobu, 197 out of 199. Suns autograph. Chris Layton with Phoenix. By the time I get to Phoenix, she'll be rising. She'll leave a note right on the door. Patrick Beverly to 299. Patrick Beverly, 215 out of 299. Clippers with that one. And hit the bell there. The die cut is Markel Fultz. Sixers edition goes to Jesse. Markel Fultz could possibly get some new life. In Orlando, this will still go to Jesse and the Sixers out of 65. All right, and the last box. Good luck. But for honors, I, I don't know how they configured it, Bob. Um, but I know that they, they, they did load up last time they did honors football. They did really load it up. I would imagine that it would be loaded up this time around too. I'm sure they didn't screw with the, the configuration very much.
Drop, drop, drop. No. It's not gonna happen. All right, last box. Good luck, boys and girls. There's Marvin Bagley the third. I mean, Kings are gonna have a really nice team next year, I think. They can add a couple more pieces. They're not in the. I don't think they're in the playoffs, right? I think they've just missed it. Kings are playing tonight. They're hosting the Rockets. Yeah, they're out. Yeah, the West is set. That's right. The West is all set except for seeding seeds. Um. But if the if the Kings can if they can add, you know if they they add a free agent or two, all the, all these young guys get another year another year under their belt. It could be a very exciting team. Sacramento Kings with that one that'll be for uh, for Mark Glassman. Well, Mari Spellman, relic. Mark Masson with the Hawks. Yeah, playoffs around the corner, Tice. Yeah, the Kings just missed it. They're not, they're not quite there. Or not just missed it, but... I think they were in the hunt for a little bit. But the rest of the West pulled away. But I think... I think they could, they could get playoff next year. There's Patrick Ewing. Top selections gold. Two out of ten for the Knicks. That's pretty cool. Who's got the Knicks? Mark Matheson. That is cool. And there's another 33 right there, Jeremy. Oh, playoffs? Yeah, playoffs. It's not technically my version. I'm, I'm blanking on that Colts coach name. You can't wait to see Zion dunk on LeBron James? It'll probably happen. A lot of people have been... I think Lonnie Watt or Jared Allen dunked on. Get out of here. Grand Slam Cody Bellinger. That's his fifth home run of the season already. Cody Bellinger's locked in, folks. Lonnie Walker the fourth. People like him too. Jersey and autograph out of one ninety nine for the Spurs. Boombox with the Spurs. Ooh. There's Clint Capella. Jersey and autograph for the Rockets. I go to Matt Stone. Yep, Bellinger's fifth of the season. He just hit it. Grand slam. 99 out of 199. Jerome Robinson out of 299. And there you go. That's it. Thanks, everybody. That's a, What a case this has been. A lot of great stuff. A lot of solid veteran autographs, retired player autographs, Luca autographs. Pretty amazing stuff. Thanks, everybody. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.